beach guys <laughs> and my nose is so red i'm slightly red here my neck my body is slightly on fire i fell asleep on sun yeah i will pay for it tomorrow or tonight so right now i'm going to apply some masks <laughs> to get my skin to feel a little bit better because we're having dinner in a couple hours we are going to faina to this amazing argentinian steakhouse I need on my nose too <laughs> i usually don't apply <laughs> vip two on my face except under my eyes but i feel like the nose needs it today thank god i have it honestly this is a really great mask for summer guys great 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 gonna put here under my eyes above my eyes there we go do I look funny i so don't care and then the biomagic mask 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 What kind of thick layer i just saw i was passing by the kitchen after i showered that the groceries were delivered so i'm gonna have some orange juice or grapefruit juice with ice <laughs> i don't usually like to drink cold stuff but i feel like today was such a beautiful day it's so hot in miami guys i'm so sorry for telling you that because you probably live up north but Miami is having like the best weather this week. It's really nice and it was windy, slightly breezy. That's why I didn't feel the heat and now I will pay for it. Exactly. <laughs> so I'm gonna say hello to my husband so he gets scared. <laughs> he already got used to all these looks. I'm like, what is my towel? <laughs> it's on my head. <laughs> you see my hand is red as well. I just used my body lotion, my necessary body lotion. This is my third and I feel like the skin is going to be okay. <laughs> but god damn, I'm using new SPF, which is like natural and I don't think the natural is as strong as I was expecting. Ready to go. Do I look scary? I hate when they do groceries into plastic bags. That is so stupid. Gosh, Miami, when are you gonna learn your lesson and stop using plastic bags? Voila, there we go. Some fruits, banana, egg, olive oil. My husband lives on raisins. I'm lately obsessed with Mexican Coca-Cola and sparkly water, orange juice, grapefruit juice, avocados, sardines, I love sardines, some snack bars, a little bit of bread, some fruits, and my favorite yogurt. So that's all. That is all. Okay. So I am getting ready for a dinner tonight. And can you see how pink is it here? No, good. I'm going to apply my serum detent, guys. This is the number three tone. So how I like to apply it, I will first clean up the... See, because it gets like dry. I haven't used it in a long time. So I'm just gonna put one pump on a brush. some hair in it this is a bobby brown i guess foundation blush brush and you see how much darker it is you just quickly gently blend it to your skin and another pump for the other side i like that it's so dark right now because i got little tan today so i won't look so pale that's good 
So serum, the tint is a serum guys. Don't forget, you see the color, <laughs> so dark. Um, don't forget that it's not foundation, so it does not really have much of coverage. It just like makes your skin even and the product like sits on your face. It doesn't really like go inside of your skin like foundation and you can, you know, blend, 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 blend. This doesn't work that way. So I have half of it gone because um, honestly, I don't use it that often. It's just like a special treatment product because I don't use really foundations these days or the serum the taint. <laughs> I know it's a foundation, but you know what I mean. So I don't really use it. Only when we go for like nice dinner, I use it like tonight. We're going out. So I want to show you. It looks very nice. I'm waiting for it to dry. This is the brush I use for it. It's just very basic. I think anything will work. It's, I just prefer something a little bit thick like this. If you want to apply anything on top of this serum, be very gentle not to remove the serum with the product you're applying. You see, like, don't do heavy strokes. Just dab it. That's it. My nose is so red, you cannot see it on the camera. Can you see it? No. <laughs> What's going on with the light here? I'm gonna try to put some bronzer on. And this is NARS. See how fluffy, soft brush is this? I'm just gonna dip it very gently and lightly. So I will remove the serum detent. There is a lot of art to it. <laughs> this is my first weekend off in a really, really long time. And now I will apply my uh, Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk. Yes, the Pillow Talk cheeks. And that's it. Again, I will just Dab it guys, don't go wild, you don't want to remove your serum from your face. Like it happened to me many times in the past. Very good. So now you can see how freaking pink I am. I'm pink like a salmon. <laughs> but this is the dress. Yes, I'm burnt. Can you see that? Ouch. So we went for brunch and then decided to finally go and purchase a plant and I have to take it out of the plastic, put it in a vase and put the soil in. I have never done this, so this will be really exciting, I think, we'll see.
guys i need vacation so bad you have no idea i am exhausted i did sleep today till 7 30 yesterday i slept till 8 because of where my day is off which was quite nice but i'm just feeling so exhausted i don't know what's going on i think it's my diet i haven't been very good with my diet lately i need to eat a little bit more healthy need some salads which means i need to do groceries because i don't have any salad in the house so yeah i just ordered lunch here we go <laughs> because i was not feeling like cooking at all and let me show you what i like to get in this restaurant it's a salmon on a sa top of salad with avocado and all these goodies i got a little bit of quinoa i will have one of these veggies empanadas with two dressings green tahini and pure ravida sauce and as well delicious juice i am so hungry cannot wait to eat oh my god what time is i think it's like 6 30 i just finished my workout time to take a shower because i need to get ready to work my favorite part of the week right don't we all love to go get ready for work right not really yeah i got you i just finished my workout i feel so proud because today it was literally so hard to get to it it was impossible guys i want to show you how my plant looks it looks so freaking pretty look at that i'm so happy the light is really bad i have to turn there we go i'm so happy i got it it's so freaking gorgeous it reaches about to my ties like upper ties so it's kind of big but isn't it pretty i wanted to put something here in the corner where uh, we used to sleep so to have like a life here i don't know if you know what i mean is it already dying oh do i need more water in it guys i am really not good with plants <laughs> i have to learn but i put a lot of water in it when uh, i was changing it yes i changed the soul with my own hands on a balcony here so guys i have to say this morning was incredibly hard for me to get up i did it <laughs> i slept in a little bit because i have been waking up at 5 a.m for such a long time i am like physically and mentally exhausted yes it's not easy <laughs> for me either even i do it it's just really exhausting so this morning i actually slept till 8:30 so oops my hand just like shaked so i finally feel a little bit of uh, rest so when i woke up i couldn't get myself to work out and i was like talking myself out of it i was just like perhaps i can have a coffee no no i don't like to have coffee before i work out <laughs> so i didn't do it then i was like perhaps i can clean i was just like mm -mm, just do your workout sometimes it's really hard i was just like perhaps i can just watch tv for 10 minutes or i can you know work on my youtube channel take some pictures i was just like no iveta you got to do your workout because you've been slacking and i have been eating lately a lot of bad food so so my husband was quiet the whole time when i was working out like no phone call the second i take my camera out he gets this phone call of his friends and they're laughing like crazy <laughs> i'm not very happy he's happy it's just like i want you to hear me so i will have to put music in the background which is okay <laughs> it's okay it's okay i have to do a little treatment of my face because i slept good but my face is still like in a process of waking up so i'm gonna do some masks guys and i am in big past two of uh, micro needling i need to get rid of this little thing which i got last weekend on a beach when i fell asleep i had had, had spf i had it all but sometimes it happens so i just want to show you quickly what i got some new things which i add to my little daily routines so first of all i purchased this because i burned my skin last week i'm like super greasy i'm so sorry that's kind of disturbing right so kula 70 percent organic 
after sun radical recovery i did use aloe vera when i burned which of course this has aloe vera and it worked but i felt like i needed something a little bit better because i honestly don't like how aloe vera like the creams you purchase in like uh, cvs i don't like how they feel on the skin so i was like let me try something else let's see how this looks never tried this before. sorry never tried this before guys Okay, it has like light pepperminty sweet scent. Hmm, interesting. I hope it will work. Perhaps I can keep it in like in a fridge cooler. It's not doesn't feel really cool though. Interesting. Let's see guys. If I burn I will use this. And I have the feeling this summer I'm really gonna enjoy the beach a lot. So this will be really, in a, you know, in need to have for me. Lately, I have been really obsessed with this product, guys. I already have one. I got one for my husband and I bought new one. Spongel, Spongelogy, Spongelogy, that's how you say it? By Spongelly. I have no idea how to say it, guys. This is it. This is it. <laughs> that's what I was trying to pronounce. So it's a spongy for 20 plus washes, which is actually soaked, it's infused with uh, oils and like things, which is, let me tell you exactly, essential oil fragrance con contains extracts of rosehip, green tea and hibiscus. This thing smells so amazing. So it comes wrapped like this and it's kind of hard. So you just unwrap it. Oh my god, it smells so good. You soak it in the water, you don't need extra soap to it because it's really soaked in a many products, like essential oils, as I say. And you just use it on your body and it's perfect light scrub. It's not too aggressive. Some can be a little too much. This one is just perfect. I already have one, so I'm not gonna be opening this one. And I'm just gonna put it back in the box and leave it for later. It says plus 20, 20 washes plus, which I don't think so, honestly. <laughs> it took me about a week to remove all the products. But just the spongy by itself, it's perfect with just like basic hair, like shower soap. So I love this. And my next addiction, guys, is this necessary company. I've been using their hand cream, their body creams their shower gels this is my second one and i like that i like the, the sandalwood mm, yes i like it yes i love 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 so obsessed with them very much i already am on the third body lotion it's unbelievable unbelievable it soaks so fast to your skin it doesn't leave like you know the nasty sticky feeling it's perfect and the next thing which I, things next thing one thing which i just received is a body scrub and i got the one from barbara sturm because sturm sturm whatever because that's only what i like at sephora website and i needed to ship at sephora because i needed that the body wash so let's see this one is guys the soft one made in germany So you just put it on your hand and oh yeah i'm glad i got the soft one <laughs> so i'm new to dry brushing i used to try and it was brutal i didn't like it but i feel lately because i've been sitting so much at work my legs get very tired sometimes they get a little swollen and i feel definitely that the blood flow it's not correct even i do walk two miles a day or more I still feel like there is like a little bit more needed so this I hope will help me even if it's not exactly nice feeling so dry brushing it's it will be part of my routine now they say you should do it twice a week so we'll see and this one is from Barbara Sturm Sturm whatever how you say her name I think if she's German it's Sturm no 
but it helps. So yeah, I just created a lot of mess here in my sink because I threw all the boxes here. <laughs> so anyway, now I'm gonna take shower. First, I will use this all over my body, mainly my legs. And I'm gonna get ready for the day because today, guys, I'm meeting my friend for dinner. It's her birthday dinner. And before that, I go for manicure, because this is again my nails grow like crazy i feel like i need to go like every two weeks for manicure now unbelievable what is going on what is going on i don't know i don't know i just washed my face and i'm gonna apply actually my p50 capillary to my scalp guys because i didn't apply it in a few days this helps my hair to grow healthy my scalp is not so oily no more even in this humidity of miami now i just massage it and i'm gonna leave it on for a little while because i'm gonna put my mask on so let's say 20 30 minutes <laughs> even you should not put the mask on for 30 minutes on but sometimes i like to do that guys of course, then I turned into a very weird looking creature, but it's okay, my husband already gets used to it, so... Okay, let's do it! I'm starting with my VIPO2 under my eye to brighten up my vision. <laughs> I know, I'm nuts, guys. Lately, I have been so tired. I don't know what is going on. Well, so first I had COVID, right, in December. I was home technically a month and then you know Albi got sick and she had to go and i'm finally getting myself to the stage when when i talk about her i don't cry still not all the time sometimes it just happens it depends who talks to me <laughs> about it and yeah i mean i still cry literally every day a little bit when i drive to work or from work or when I'm taking my bath after work, things like that still happens, but it's not as bad anymore because I kind of accept that she's gone. And to have her ashes home makes me feel a little bit better. Buy a magic mask, guys. This is the red carpet mask. So this is the mask before you go out. I mean, I'm meeting my friend <laughs> for dinner today. A restaurant called Le Jardin, which is I believe like French 2020 style restaurant because it's like super healthy kind of food. It's not very French food, so I mean I will find out. She's been there already a few times. For me, it's the first time, so I'm very excited. And before that, I go for manicure. Anyway, so yeah, that's my <laughs> red carpet event today, and I haven't seen her since COVID started. I just took my Creo sticks from the freezer and guys it's completely frozen it's been there for a long time i haven't used it for a while <laughs> it's frozen can you tell i may want be putting this on my face at the moment i'm gonna put it under water hot water so cold I can't even hold it in my hand. <laughs> I'm applying my oligo proteins. To brighten up my skin. So, let's do it again. Okay, I may just do like this way. This is by the way perfect guys. I don't know why I'm not using it more often. I was so into buying it and now I'm like not using it, but it's perfect. I will use my skin SkinCeutical CE Spherulic Serum. I have it for quite a time. Just three dots to protect my face from the sun. I have noticed some people like to use C serum 
for night but I don't really know why because at night there is no sun you're mostly going to sleep my VIP O2 eye cream I know some people don't care for eye creams because they think it's just a face cream which is expensive <laughs> right but honestly I cannot use the VIP O2 cream on my face it just doesn't work for me but I love 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 the VIP O2 under my eyes to brighten up you know the dark circles so that's why I like to use it guys and I have this uh, tester of Dermo RL cream so a really pedating face cream I feel that sounds pretty good I have the placenta cream which I use for daytime but I'm gonna give a try to this one because I used it last night when I came home and my skin was kind of tired looking and I like it. Look, this it's like more thick. I feel... I feel like it's good. I don't know how it's gonna do under makeup because it's kind of more moisturizing. But let's see. So, samples are so important, right? And I still have my Caudalie sample of the Vino Pure Serum. So, as you know... I like to use samples of not biologic research <laughs> on my neck because you have to treat this area as well in your decolle. There we go. And now I'm just gonna quickly massage my face. I love my Jona check roller, you know it, you know it. So I'm just gonna massage a little bit more of my jawline because I feel that always needs more. Even I slept so good last night. Finally, I'm getting a little bit more sleep after my little, no little, after my family tragedy. So yeah, this just feels so good. The rollers slide better, of course, than the gua sha. So I understand why some people like rollers more because gua sha is kind of uncomfortable. <laughs> so now I'm going to put my eyebrows on, <laughs> cover these dark parts in my corners, and I will put some product to my hair. And I think I will prepare soup, guys, because I've been trying to cook my. Minestrone alla Iveta soup for quite time because when I get after work I usually get really hungry and I've been eating bread. I don't want to do that no more <laughs> because it's just not good for my thighs. <laughs> it's just really not good. So in age of something fell. <laughs> what was it? Anyway, in the age of 30, almost seven, 36 and a half. <laughs> You kind of have to think of these things a little bit more, especially if you work in a place where you like sit like I do for like eight hours. I mean, I can walk, but not much. My, my place where I work is very tiny boutique. So I mostly sit and I'm not physically active unless I do my workout. So I have to think of it and vegetable soup is perfect for the evening because you don't have really much carbs. I'm gonna put potato, but it's okay. <laughs> But I mean, it's better than cheese with uh, bread, you know, and bresaola. Even I have been eating uh, uh, kimchi with it. I am loving kimchi, guys. I don't know what's going on. I'm obsessed with kimchi. I'm going to show you which one I buy. So, you know, I'm going to let my hair dry almost completely before I dry it. Where is... What I have here, guys, I have brunt pale. I think that will work. I 
that looks so fake right now. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> that looks not good. I'm gonna put the, let me see. I don't know, then maybe that was a mistake. It's not matching with my eye color right now. So I just take it off a little bit. Whatever. I put on the under eye concealer and I look so pale. <laughs> Let me just fix the issue a little bit. I didn't dip it in a bronzer or anything. I'm just using the leftover because I'm home for now. And before I go out, you know, I don't apply foundation really anyway. Only when I apply my serum de tint or things like that is when I go out with my husband. So there we go. I'm ready for a day. So I did eyeshadow a little bit more heavy today because I'm meeting my friend later. So I just want to have it done. And I perhaps just put mascara on and eyeliner and that's it. So my eyebrows, my eyes are done. My face looks a little bit more healthy now. Definitely my skin is glowing, guys. I like the cream. It maybe is a little bit more greasy than uh, placenta, for sure I feel that. But I feel sometimes it's good because lately my skin has been a little bit on a roller coaster. I don't know why. Or maybe I do. Because I've been drinking a lot of alcohol. Not a lot, I have a glass of wine a day. Technically, you should have like two glasses a week. I'm 37, six, I'm 36. Jesus, how I forget how old I am. I've worked with people who keep calling me old because they are in their 20s. I'm just like, wow. You know, when I was in my 20s, no, I did that too. I did that too. Yeah, yeah, I did that. Whatever, I think cook. cooking calms me down <laughs> this is what i'm planning to put to my soup cauliflower carrots leek um zucchini what is this parsley parsnip potato and of course onion and some garlic so yeah this is my water bottle which i have here i have to wash it so i'm just gonna wash all these and i'm gonna make my soup that's a plan right <laughs> Please excuse the mess. So I have my uh, cauliflower, zucchini, leek, potato, carrot, and parsnip chopped. I'm gonna try to add a little bit of curry powder into the soup today. And of course, I'm gonna squeeze some garlic. So guys, I use uh, this uh, chicken broth for my soup. It's the first time me trying it. I kind of like it, I have to say. And here is everything cooking. It's uh, way to go. Excuse the mess. And my hair is getting to the stage of to being ready to be dried. So I'm gonna work on that. So I have to get ready because I am going for my manicure and then I'm meeting my friend. And I took too long to make the soup. So now I'm running out of time. So by the way, the soup is unbelievably delicious. I usually buy minestrone soup in my favorite Italian restaurant here in the location live at. And I try to like copy what they do and I think I did kind of a good job. Not perfect because they still do something different spices perhaps, but it was pretty good. You see, that's what I wanted. <laughs> Don't know. Weird. Sometimes it happens. Sometimes it doesn't know. And this I like straight because I'm just gonna put it behind my ear. How this looks. Here is obviously better wave on the one side than the other but that's okay guys it doesn't have to be perfect and i'm gonna use igk 30,000 feet spray excuse my husband screaming in the background as you know 
the New York thing is still happening. Even we have 10 years in Miami. That never leaves. <laughs> so this is like dry shampoo, but not really. It gives you like volume, but if you put too much of the product, it like glues your hair together. <coughs> and it's kind of, don't inhale it. I forgot. <laughs> Wow, I forgot I had it and I was cleaning all the day my cabinet and I found it so I was like oh my god I have to use it gives you this nice little hippie look <laughs> you get to brush it down of course there we go this works so mascara where is it somewhere not here My manicure girl will be so surprised to see me <laughs> with the makeup on today because I usually go there very casual <laughs> and today I'm supposed to like dress up a little bit because I have dinner with my friend after my manicure at the same location I have to take umbrella I just don't know where is the restaurant I need to google it So much better, no? Now the brown there to look tan. <coughs> Still the powder. Crab fruit juice. I love crab fruit juice, guys. In a wine glass, the best. My friend, so I posted a picture of my biologic research on my Instagram and my friend just told me, I think I'm gonna cancel my beauty heroes thing, whatever is that, I think it's like subscription to get like beauty suppliers and I get all this. So yeah, another friend got hooked. <laughs> He is like so much into skincare. This friend is actually the person who got me into skincare even deeper. I used to be very much into retinol and that's how we connected. <laughs> this company called Tazorac, which is a prescription retinol for your face. We both used it and we were like, oh my God, we work together. And we were like, oh my God, <laughs> we're using the same products. We are best friends now. And five years later, we are, you know, friends. <laughs> there he goes again. <laughs> <laughs> Always sends me jokes. You know, I enjoy people who make me laugh so much. We have to appreciate the good people in our lives because there's so many suckers, right? Who try to take our energy away and are very unwishful. People are very unwishful. I had noticed that. It's kind of sad. How much of the powder I inhaled? So I think I just do black t shirt and jeans. And some high heels, of course. I just don't know which one. Dilemmas, right? Dilemmas. <laughs> Still loud in the background. Guys, if you follow my videos, you know that's part of it. 